We now have dates and times for two presidential debates between Donald Trump and Joe Biden. After trading jabs on social media this morning, the two have accepted invitations by CNN and ABC. The first debate in Atlanta on Thursday, June 27th on CNN. The second debate Tuesday, September 10th on ABC. Political director Andrew Rafferty joins us live now. Andrew, a, a kind of a, a back and forth this morning between uh, Trump and Biden. How did these two debates come together? Well, hey there, Chris. Yeah, it was Donald Trump who said, let's get ready to rumble. And that came after those event eventual overtures from the Biden campaign. Very specific dates and times where these debates are to be held. So this has been moving a lot this morning up until the early afternoon. Here's what we know. We do know that June 27th will be a CNN debate. That's from Atlanta. And just moments ago, it was at September 10th debate that was both agreed agreed upon by both candidates now there are some outstanding questions from donald trump's campaign most specifically they have suggested two more debates than joe biden and his campaign originally said they want one in july and in august but those ones are still very much tbd the reality chris is this both campaigns feel that these debates will greatly greatly benefit them for Donald Trump. He feels this is a way to showcase that Joe Biden has essentially lost a step, that he doesn't have the sort of faculties to continue to be president for the Biden campaign. And they've said this for quite a while now. They see it as a chance to remind people of what Donald Trump's presidency was like, the chaos, the sort of off the cuff, uh, foot in mouth sort of gaffes that they believe that Donald Trump would make if he were to be on a debate stage. Now, we did have a senior uh, spokesperson for the Biden campaign on Scripps News just a little bit ago talking about why they feel it's so important to listen uh, and to have these debates. Take a listen. The American people deserve to hear from Donald Trump and Joe Biden, and they deserve to hear about the stakes of this election. This is not about a spectacle. This is not about an entertainment option. This is about making sure the American people know that Joe Biden wants to take this country forward. He wants to make sure every American has opportunity. He wants to make sure every American has the right to make their health care decisions. And he wants to make sure they know that Donald Trump wants to reverse that progress. So, Chris, what else should not be lost in this is just how early these debates are. The Commission on uh, Presidential Debates has hosted every debate since 1988, every presidential debate, that is. They traditionally start in the fall. The ones this time around were scheduled to begin in September. So to have a debate in June uh, is really, really early. It's a testament to, A, how important both these campaigns feel this is, and B, to just how people are changing their voting habits. A lot of this voting is going to happen well before November as a product of some of the changes that happened during the pandemic in 2020. And Andrew, you talked about some of the things that are still being worked out right now. What are, are some of the other details the two campaigns are, are trying to come to an agreement on? Well, look, it's important to note that, yes, you can agree to a debate in theory and have the rug sort of pulled out from under because the devil is always in the details. It's going to be about those moderators, who's actually on stage asking questions. Of course, the president has been very critical of the media in general, but specifically CNN. So how they play up uh, and the rules around that first debate will be really interesting to watch. Another thing is a VP debate. Both campaigns have expressed interest in doing that. That, of course, would happen after uh, President Trump, former President Trump, accepts and chooses a nominee to be his running mate. Uh, that might be in late July after the Republican conventions. And, of course, the other big outstanding thing is that Donald Trump wants more debates than just the two plus VP debate that we've been talking about, whether or not Joe Biden agrees to additional debates, I think is gonna be another really interesting thing to watch over the next few weeks. And we'll see how it comes together. Political Director Andrew Rafferty for us live in Washington. Andrew, thank you.